A local nonprofit in Denver is dedicated to keeping cyclists moving. The group called Bikes Together teaches people how to repair their own bikes. So the goal here is to remove barriers surrounding cycling. As Denver 7's Colette Bordelon shares, what makes the shop special is the staff and the people they serve. Yeah. The best part of teaching Your news ready. is when a student no longer needs the teacher. Folks yeah. can come in and get both the tools and the support. That's the point of these learn and repair sessions at Bikes Together. Do you know how much air to put in it? We're Molly Dillian-Shear, who spent her life on a bike. Since I was a wee one in Lakewood. Is one of their mechanics. Many of us who are not white, who yeah. are not male, or not perceived as male, um, don't always get that luxury. So, um, yeah, it's an opportunity to learn some of the jargon, to like learn how things work. The nonprofit community bike shop that's been around for over a decade is proud to create a space where everyone is welcomed and wanted. Anybody can work on a bike. Their executive director, Abby Bohannon, says the cycling community can sometimes feel a bit exclusive. A lot of times we see people who come into bikes together who have been turned away at another shop because it's too expensive or because, um, you know, maybe they don't have the right questions to ask. Bohannon says what matters most is making sure bikes are accessible to anyone. It's quite a fantastic machine in terms of um, yeah, helping people have agency over their own transportation, helping people have agency over their own life. Like one of their students at the Learn and Repair session. Salvador is somebody who, um, yeah, I've seen in the shop before. You know, we have a pretty good rapport. Salvador, who's been riding his bike for months without brakes. He was noticing that his shoes were starting to get worn out because his, his technique for braking was just to put his foot on the ground when he was going downhill. Eh, it depends. That's like the max. Today he got breaks and, and we helped him keep rolling safely for free. Because what the mechanics learned from the shop. So you just want to make sure you can see it all the way around. Okay. Is something they want to share. All right, guys. Bye. Have a good night. Get home safe. Starting a new cycle. Yes, it's the best way. One that spurs independence. Colette Bordelon, Denver 7. And Bikes Together is one of the nonprofits you can donate to as part of Colorado Gives Day next Tuesday. That nonprofit relies on donations to keep going.